Hi guys, it's Chrissyboy94 back again here with my next Skyrim uh, glitch video. Uh, now today I am going to be showing you how to get under this place or on top of his head if you really want to. You can get all around the back of here but where like we can see through here. I'll show you how to get behind here and also access his shop. Now, picture this, I'll show you this quickly. Underneath the floor here is a secret chest which contains, to prove it, all of his inventory. Mm -hmm. So you ask him what he's got God to sell, the Dwarven Sword, all of this stuff, all of his apparel, anything like that. All of his that, even ingots and stuff, and his money, 1,175. Check all that, yep. So he's got that all for that sale, and that is in a he's secret done. hidden chest where the game calls it. So whenever like you open the store, the game will go to that chest and it opens it and loads it as his store. Now, I'm going to show you how you get under the map and access that chest. And it is uh, quite simple. I've had a couple of people ask me how I do it. Or how, how you do it. Yes, yeah, just ignore the route I'm taking if you are running from here from the Skyforge. But as soon as you come in from like town, you just come straight up the path. I mean, I can... You know, yeah, that that there is the um, blacksmith. You come straight up this path, and you go this way. So you turn left. You go over the wooden plank. Wooden plank. <laughs> Walk the plank, Aramiti. You come up here, and now the aim is you're gonna drop through this wall here. Sounds weird, I know. First thing is to get here and jump on. Oh dear. Um, yeah, I do also want to mention quickly that um, this does require. Uh, I mean, I've done it a couple of times, just like practice for this, but it does require um, saving a lot if you want to do it, like, you know, so you don't have to sit there and redo it loads. But some of it's, and basically, what you want to do is you just want to walk side to side, bashing Y to jump, and eventually you'll hit a spot where you can jump, and there you go, you're on the thing. Right? Now, here, some people want to save it, I'm not going to, and I'm probably going to balls it up because of it. See, there we go. Um, it, it can take a little while. Um, to be honest, ah, there we go. You gotta get yourself back up on this thing, and it is very like the game does try and push you off on stuff like here. The best way to do it is go around the back of the. Oh dear, is um, some people like to stand on it and like sprint and then get sprint right. But I find if you jump up on it and then go around to the back where my cursor is now and then try and crawl up on it, so like this. So you're on it here. You gotta sneak there and then you got ah. See, it can take a couple of tries. No harm in that. And oh, there you go. So we're on the back of the horse. You just want to give it a bit of a push. And you'll, you'll ev there we go. Ooh, ooh. And you'll eventually do that, <laughs> or you'll eventually fall off doing this times like me. Um, but basically, you're aiming to get on top of the horse's head, and it isn't. And uh, I would say, I would say that this is the hardest part of the glitch: is getting onto the horse's head. For me, anyway. Others might find it a tad easier, but that this is the hardest part for me to do. The next bit, I, I oh there we go. See, you're on top. Now most people again would save here. I am because of the stress. I just had to get through to a uh, <laughs> ticket on it. And now some people struggle with running and jumping straight at it. And so I want to find what's better. If, if you stand to the side and look that way, and then you do this, see, straight on. I never had a problem with it. Sideways jump always gets it for me. Right, now the next bit is tricky if you want to save it here, you know, recommend to. Now if you aim like there, you won't hit it. There's like an invisible barrier you have to thing where the map's been created. So you want to just step over a bit and you kinda of want to aim for the right hand side of the wall. So you, you just hit the ledge, I'll show you what I mean. So if you oh, see, I've done it. It's it's an uh, easy thing to do. And you want to get, on, like I said, on the left-hand side of that wall, but not obviously over the wall. You're aiming. It sounds weird. I'll show you. You've got to get inside of it. So, hang on. Let's just hop over. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> Silly me. Hang on. We'll get this right. It does It does take um, a little bit of time. I mean, if you, if, I've, I've practiced this a little bit so I could get it right for the purpose of this video because people have been asked uh, a couple of people have asked me 
and it's I'm still straight up here so there you go you are aim for about there there we go you fall straight down here mind that massive gap now you are follow this around and you have to do a bit of sprinting there don't go through there that's obviously the main gate to white run oops Sky Skyrim sorry out of white run to Skyrim you're under the map at the moment and you want to just follow where I'm walking around you just want to go, go around as well Take you a minute or something just to, just to run around here wrong way <clears throat> now doing this you can exploit the chest which is what I'm going to be showing you um, you could also get on top of like certain things and that but I find that I don't really see the point in it it's pretty view but you know I prefer, I prefer the gold <laughs> and all the items come on stamina god Oh, I'm also, if you, in case you're wondering, I'm pretty sure it works on PC. I'm currently playing this on Xbox 360 and this hasn't been patched. As you can see, I'm now running under the map. But I'm on Xbox 360. So here we are. So now you want to start climbing up this way. So if you've been following where I've run in through the video, you want to come up here and you'll think, oh, there's a big invisible, like, oh, a big thing, we, there's going to be a gap here. There's not, you can quite easily walk on it. It's going to be absolutely fine. And you come up onto here. Now, these bits here, there'll be like a wall type thing here, so you have to stay quite close to the left as you can... Oh. <laughs> the one time! So, there you go, there is a bit of a wall pushing you there. So you want to stay nice to the left, here we go, there it is, pop over it. So now you see where at the start of the video, I was like round the back there, and I could see him working. You can climb up all the way on this left hand side and go on the head and stuff, and jump back over if you want. Now I'm going to show you how you get under it. This rock, <gasps> visible, <gasps> under here. Voila, you are under the sky forge. Just a simple trick, and over there is the chest. It's quite safe to just walk up to it. You go up to it, search the chest, and everything that that guy sells is in that chest. And you, it's not even theft, it's just a straight up steal. So I'm going to take all of his ingots, all of his money, or leather strips. This comes in handy as well if you want to jump up your a smithen. And so yeah, I've, ro I've robbed everything that I really need, like, I did see something that I was going to rob. Not for me, just for selling it. Oh, there you go. Take glass shield. And if you want to know how you get out of here, very simple. You can go back up if you want and jump straight down if you want to get to him quick as. Even quicker, I find, is just a straight sprint and run towards these stairs. You see where we're coming from, back there, where we fell down there. And you run straight across and there's a staircase here. And if you just keep walking towards it, all of a sudden... You pop out. Nice and easy. Simple as. You run back up. Voila. Now to prove it was his chest, I'm going to quickly bolt up here. Sorry, this is taking a little bit longer. And talk to him. What have you got for sale? 28 gold. Some of the weapons are missing. He has no misks. I took it all. I took all of his stuff. And yeah, it's as simple as that. Uh, if, you've en mm -hmm. if you've enjoyed watching this, you know, like and favourite, it helps. Uh, subscribe if you, um, if you want to see some more. Um, I'm going to be. There should already be one up, a speech level 100. Uh, I've got a couple more uh, tricks as such. This is the one really only glitch as such. This is getting under the map um, and getting into his chest. But yeah, I've been Boy 94 and thank you for watching.